So hello, this is me again, Vince, and welcome to, uh, for now, the last um, tier list video that I'm going to be making. I'm not just going to do these Godzilla ones, of course, so I might do like other franchises like horror, though, or video games and, or stuff like that, or other characters from other movies and stuff. But excuse if you can hear any noise, it's my TV in the background, but I think like I, I'm noticing before the microphone doesn't catch a lot of that stuff, so that's pretty good at least, but... Today we're going to be um, doing the Godzilla characters tier list um, video. We did Godzilla um, designs. We did um, the actual movies. And um, on New Year's last year, we did um, the human characters. So now we're actually going to talk about the certain monsters here. And I'm assuming that it's not specific. All like, yeah, it is. Okay, I see certain designs here. So it might be specific ones. So... Well, this tier list is different because it doesn't have it doesn't go S to F. It actually has some um, titles and stuff like literal gods, almost the best, but not gods. Uh, good kaiju, neither good or bad kaiju would favor better kaiju, but still has their own own advantages. Lots of weaknesses, little to no abilities, and no abilities, absolute trash. So um. Uh, again, excuse the noise, though. Actually, I might as well just do this. Hold on. There we go. Um, so let's jump right into this one, though, since we've been doing these, though. But um, I just did post my Scream uh, final trailer reaction video. And uh, yesterday I did post the Unexplained Crypto Media episode um, for this year, the new episode that just came out. So check those out, as well as my update video that I did um, last year. And I do have an... A little update in that unexplained crypto media video though but i won't get too much into that so let's just jump right into this so this should be easier than the human characters tier list and the uh, the movies um tier list now we got to put godzilla up in gods though come on and as well as Ghidorah, uh mothra and rodan rodan so put them up there um, Viren. I think Viren's got to go up there. I like. I, he's one of my favorite obscure Godzilla monsters. Oh, Kong. He's got to go up there too. Come on. And uh, An Anguirus. Anguirus go up there though. Um, because I love Anguirus. I always loved Anguirus as a kid though. He's really cool. Really wish he would come back. Well, he did. Never mind. He came back in um a singular point. It was exciting seeing him there, and that him back after like Final Wars. So. Um, speaking of which, there's the GM, the 2001, uh, Baragon down there, so I'm going to put him in almost the best, because I like Baragon, but not that much, though. I know a lot of people like Baragon. Uh, Batra, Batra, evil Mothra, basically. The Thanos of, uh, the Godzilla universe, if you will. Um... I'll put him here too because I like him though. This list is going to be very strange though with um, Godzilla monsters though. So uh, I like Batcher. He's cool. I wish he would appear more stuff though, but he is cool. I'll put him in there. Uh, Ibra? Uh, right in the middle for me. He's cool, but he's neither good or bad uh, monster. It's a giant lobster. It's cool, but he's not going like any higher. Hedra. Hedra's going up here, though. I do like Hedra. I'm not putting him in literal gods, though. He is he is pretty cool, though. I like Hedra, the concept of it, and the, the monster's cool. Manda. Manda. Put him in good. He's he's basically a uh, water serpent or a chain, uh, uh, Asian like dragon, almost. So it's cool that he came back, and I'm seeing the point as well, as well as Hedra. At least it was just a cameo. Uh, Kumanga. Uh, uh, same thing with him. He's neither good or bad. He's a giant spider, and he shoots webs. He's cool though, but um, uh, it's the same thing with Ebra. Um, Gabra, Gabra. Mm. I like the creature. He's cool in singular point again. I would. Mm. Yeah, I would favor him other monsters, though. He's he's an interesting, weird monster, but it's like, he's not like the greatest thing ever. Well, that was awesome. 
Ho- hopefully nobody heard that on, on the microphone, though. So Gorosaurus, I put Gorosaurus too in the good kaiju. He's basically a, a, a Allosaurus that does kangaroo kicks. He's cool. Um, Mogu- Mogira, I'm gonna say Mogura. That's not how you say it. I'll put him in neither good or bad. He's he's not. Well, actually, nah. It it, it he's. He'll go here because it's a weird design. It's like a robot chicken, basically, though. But that's what Gigan is, though. But I think he looks more like a, like a dumbed down Mechagodzilla. He's cool in the movie, but it's like eh, it's not much for me. Kamakuras, he's going in the same place as his other, um, type of uh, monsters here. Again, it's a cool creature, though. But um, it's not going up any higher. Megalon. Uh, same thing, cause Megalon is the most Ultraman, the weirdest monster in the the Godzilla franchise, besides the guy again. Since talking about him, I put him up here and good, good, cause or actually I put him up here, cause I do really like guy again. But Megalon is like a giant beetle that shoots lasers and bombs out of his mouth and flies, and he has drill hands. So like, it's a super weird creature. Though, but Guy again is cool though. He is w- just as weird, but I feel like the Final Wars does him justice. Mecha Godzilla. Oops. <laughs> um, <laughs> moving people here. Um, so let's see. I put Mecha Godzilla Little Gods. Everyone knows. Well, that's Ready Player One Mecha Godzilla. I'll put him in here. I do like that Mecha Godzilla. Jet Jaga. Jet Jaga. Da 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 da. Um, Mingya, Mingya. Mm, I'll put him here. I like Mingya. Don't get me wrong, I like him. Uh, King Cesar, King Shiza. Um, I'll put him in good. I do like the monster. It's like a dog lion god based on like those statues in Okinawa. Um, the giant octopus from King, King Kong vs Godzilla. Or um, uh, the cut scene in um, Frankenstein Conquers the World. He also appeared in um, War of the Gargantuas. I'll put him in with the rest of these monsters right here. Titanosaurus. I love Titanosaurus. Uh, actually, everyone knows my mom. <laughs> um, Bay 54. She loves uh, Titanosaurus. It's her favorite monster. He is a cool creature. It's like a, it's an aquatic dinosaur that causes um, windstorms and shit with his uh, tail fin on his, on his tail. Mecha Ghidorah, Mecha Ghidorah, Mecha Ghidorah is cool, I'll put him in Literal Gods, and, uh, you know what, that doesn't make me feel good, because he's not like King Ghidorah, I like King Ghidorah more, but Mecha King Ghidorah is um, cool, this Destroyer, 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 and Literal Gods, I love Destroyer, basically the Godzilla version of the devil, Though he's a f- cool fucking monster, though I always liked him, like the design of the creature, and Biolante, little gods. I love that monster too. The combination of Godzilla cells, uh, a doctor's daughter, and um, uh, Rose creates this horrific creature. Though here, that's super cool. Uh, Mecha Godzilla two from nineteen ninety three. I'm not super into the design, though. It's cool, Mechagodzilla, but I'll put him in, in there, though. But actually, no, I'll put him here because the design, it's meh to me. So it's like, eh, it, it is what it is. Space Godzilla. Space Godzilla. I like, I don't like his movie, but I like the monster. So uh, I'll put him in good. He's cool. I like him. Burning Godzilla. Now, come on. You, I, I can't put that anywhere else. <laughs> I like Burning Godzilla. So I got the 2019 Rodan up there. That's the 1993 Rodan. Though, um, I'll put him in good. I can't I can't fault Rodan for that. Orga. Love Orga. It's a cool creature. It's an alien um, that took some of Godzilla's DNA and like made itself into this weird creature that shoots beams out of his shoulder. Um, so both Godzilla 98 and Zilla Jr. from Godzilla the series, um, I don't want to put them in literal gods. I'll put them in almost good, but not, because I like the monster. 
though, but I do enjoy the movie as well. All right, Literal Gods. I like Mega Godzilla three. I don't know. Actually, no. I'll put him in almost good because I do like this Mega Godzilla. He is really cool, but uh, I favor him over. Um, uh, I favor other Mega Godzillas over him, though he's really cool. I like him though, but there's other ones. Kamibis. Um, this is the version from Tokyo SOS. He appeared in the Toho movie uh, Space Amoeba. I'll put him in. Uh, I'll put him in here because I think it's a cool creature. It's it's a turtle with a long extending neck. It's really cool. Um, Megaguirus. Megaguirus. Mm. I'll put him in neither good or bad. It's it's a cool monster. Again, it uses the origin of combining Godzilla's cells with a creature. But it's a giant, like, dragon, prehistoric dragonfly that moves really fast. So, it, and his movie wasn't too much of a fan of. It's a cool monster, but he's not, he can't go anywhere else, or she, I don't know, higher than that. Uh, Kaiser Ghidorah, I, I can't help. Maybe I, I'll put him in here, because I do think it's a cool King Ghidorah, though he's not a literal god, though. But it's a cool version. Uh, Shin, got to put him up here. Everyone knows I love Shin. Though the most un one of the most unique Godzillas besides the one with the skull in its head. Anyway, uh, Muto, the female Muto. They're not gods, but I do like the design of these creatures. They're very interesting, unique creatures for the Godzilla universe. Monster X, which you was I I put him over Kaiser Ghidorah because it's a interesting, cool looking monster. I like the skull, like ninja type, like look of this monster i wish we would have saw him more though besides the movie he was in uh planet eater Ghidorah. it's an interesting design but i don't like it that much though if it was look like Ghidorah, i'd be fine but it's just a bunch of floating garland everywhere though but i feel like i would want to put it lower yeah i'll put it right here <laughs> i like the design it's just that I'm not into most of the design aspects and how they made Ghidorah here. Um, Godzilla Earth. Put him there. It's a cool Godzilla. It's grown on me. But there's not much to it that makes it all more the worth, I think, though. Though, to me, at least. Uh, the Servum. Remember this creature? I think it's a cool monster, but I'll put them with Ghidorah because they're not in the movies. They aren't too much. They have attack scenes, but it's like, that's it. And and putting Mechagodzilla City there. I do not like that idea. Uh, Zone Fighter. He's cool. I've seen some stuff with him. He's an early, he was uh, after Godzilla vs. Megalon. They did, Toho did a Ultraman type series with um, Zone Fighter that had, um, these aliens and stuff come down and and they had godzilla gigan and uh Ghidorah show up in there and godzilla would help zone fighter if he was getting his ass kicked and that's where gigan actually died in in that series if you were wondering what happened to him after like godzilla versus megalon he actually got killed by zone fighter not godzilla uh he's cool i like him he's got arm cannons it's really cool godzuki from the hanna Barbera cartoon I'm just not super into him. I like the look a little bit, but I'm not super into Scooby-Doo over here, though, too much. Not not all that, though. And there's so much I can only tolerate watching that. Skullcrawler, the big one, or Mother Skull, Skullcrawler, Queen, whatever you want to call it, the big one, and including the small one, is going in almost, though, because I really like the creature. It's a really cool monster that's based on an early Kong monster from the original 33 movie uh the bamboo spider or mother long legs is i think an interesting creature it's a kamanga type monster but it's an interesting creature too uh the skewer buffalo um i put them here and these two from the comics is that the death jackal or whatever it's called I'll put them here as well as this thing from Skull Island. I guess it's like a moss fish or swamp monster or something. I don't know what it is, though, because I don't. I didn't read the comics too much. 
Well, that seems to be all the Godzilla uh, monsters, including uh, some versions. You know what? Then, actually, I should then. You know what? I'll just right here put them in god tier yeah that makes me feel good yeah that's good i think i think this is the definitive list right here um i don't know if this will change for me though i don't think so not like the other tier list because i feel f pretty satisfied with this though on what monsters i like more than others though and which ones are like mid ground for me though so um let's do this though and there where am i oh and here is the full entire list though. of course the top has more going on than the bottom because i knew doing this tier list that there was going to be less on the bottom than there was more on the top because i have a more different view on this than the other tier list than i had so i hope you guys enjoyed this last tier list though um that we did though today the godzilla monsters tier list i feel pretty satisfied with this one maybe like i said i'll revisit the other tier list in the future if my opinion changes but I feel like I'm pretty okay with this list, though, right here, though. And everyone is in a good middle, and there's good top, so, and a one good bottom. So, hope you guys all enjoyed, though. Um, stay tuned for all the content that's coming up very soon. Again, I'm going to be trying to be motivated and get active back here on YouTube, as well as my Anchor account. Though, check out the reviews over there, as well as on the YouTube channel here. Um, check out all the links at the end of the video, as well as in this, hopefully in the description though and all my social medias so yep so if you guys enjoyed it kind of share subscribe thumbs up thumbs down watch videos see you next time i'm audi 5000 watch videos and uh don't worry there's going to be godzilla stuff coming back very soon so don't think the godzilla stuff is left entirely though so i'm don't worry godzilla's going to come back so see you guys all next time